What do your Doc Martens say about you? Entitled, gentle, classic, loud. I'm just playing. I made all of that up, so don't worry about it. But today, what we're going to be doing is reading this article where the author describes what each and every Doc Martin could mean to us. Also, if your feelings are already hurt, I'm sorry, but you're going to have to buckle up for this episode. Lastly, if you like Doc Martens, please subscribe. Classic Doc Martens. Generally, you wear as much black as possible. You own corduroy pants. You listen to Mitski at least once in the past week. Classic Doc Martin owners are unapologetic. Yes, I own and wear the most recognizable pair of Doc Martens. So what? If you own these Docs, you are here for practicality, comfort, and versatility. You probably own the same Docs for years, and the environment thanks you for it. You use them to aesthetically jump in October leaves while simultaneously stomp on the patriarchy. Everyone loves you. I mean, the author is not lying. I mean, black goes with everything. <laughs> Literally, the classic blacks should be your first pair of Doc Martens because you can just wear them throughout the year. And yeah, I mean, I won't say I'm unapologetic. I mean, it is what it is. Hey, I like them. Chelsea boots. Yawn. Oh, sorry. These Docs are really boring. Don't worry, this is coming from a place of self-deprivation, as I own these myself. But even I can admit that these are the vanilla of the Doc Martin category. People own these for one of two reasons. They're too scared to own the classic Docs because they're too edgy, but want to stay fashionable. Or they want something to wear with every outfit for every occasion. Seriously, these docks can be dressed up or down so easily. Sometimes boring can have its benefits. I'm not gonna lie, I feel dumb attacked because them Chelsea boots, they're one of my favorite docks, man. I don't know why. It's just like the author said, you can dress it up, you can dress it down, but I guess to some people that's boring. To me, I just feel like it's... It's it's everything, just for that simple fact that I can do so much with it. Like whenever I put on them Chelsea boots, ooh, I feel <laughs> I feel cool. <laughs> but man, I guess I'm boring now. Edgy platform docs. Please speak up. I cannot hear you over the Phoebe Bridgers song being blasted all times in your presence. People who wear platform docs are the coolest people in existence. Everyone immediately wants to be their friend. If you wear these, the fashion industry steals runway ideas from the creative outfits you wear on the street of New York City while you chase after your art, music, or design dreams. Confident in every way, the world looks up to you for inspiration on how to be unapologetic. I mean, yes and no. I'll say the platform boots, they do give that edgy look. Maybe you might have a little bit more confident, but I don't know. Would you gain more friends just because you have platform boots? Man, this might be like a new video idea, but I really want to test this out. I mean, I know the platform boots do give like some type of confidence. You're a little bit taller, you know? You probably think like you can do everything if you have some platform boots on. So I don't know. I might have to Give me some platform boots, man. Be out here get, gaining friends and high self-esteem. Come on. You, come on. You, you can't go wrong with that. <laughs> colored docks. People with colored docks dress in one of two ways. All black, with the boots being the sole pop of color. Or with the most random mismatch of color, pattern, and texture layered into one outfit. These people are artsy, risk takers, and free spirited enough to invest in a pair of Doc Martens that make putting together outfits a daily puzzle of color theory. You challenge the rest of us to loosen up and indulge in some color every once in a while, even if it's impractical and doesn't match half of our wardrobe. 
I have to say, I mean, color matching is, it has to be a thing, but with the mismatch and everything, that's a no. No, no, no. If you're mismatching, it's up to you, but I'm not with the mismatch look, you know? I'm not a big fan of too much color anyways. I usually keep that earth tone or something light, but yeah, the colored docks, I mean, I guess risk takers, because trying to find something that goes with it is a whole big thing, but I'm not a big fan of too much color, you know? So I would have to say I'm not a risk taker when it comes to, I guess, fashion and stuff like that. But it is interesting to think. More color, risk takers, hmm. Earthy colored docks. These boots scream I listen to Lanier's or Home by Edward Sharp and The Magnetic Zero or the entirety of Taylor Swift's Folklore. You get the picture. These are the quintessential boots of people who climb trees and hike mountains. They ride their bike to the local cafe to talk to the barista about how their garden is doing while their coffee with oat milk is being made. If you own these, you're probably warm, free loving, and fun to be around. Honestly, I'll have to say, this is interesting. I kind of get that hippie vibe from this, you know? Like that cool, chill individual that's just like, yeah, it is what it is. Earth tone, like, I actually like earth tone, but I don't think I have any earth tone Doc Martens, but I kind of get the vibe that they're putting out there. It's very interesting, but I do agree to a certain degree, you know? It's an interesting thing. So that's the article. I'll have to say I am more the classic black Doc Martens and also the Chelsea boots, you know? I'm a little bit boring, but I enjoy how I can style them them uh chelsea boots it makes it easy for me like i can go anywhere with chelsea boots and i'm accepted i love that about it but let me know which one are you did the author miss anything please leave it down in the comments below but you don't want to miss out on this video it's right here top 10 doc martens check it out